Valentine's is just around the corner and you know what that means. It means it's time to start planning for your significant other. I'm going to show you guys how to make a delicious Valentine's Day dinner using the classic steak and prawns that we got from Save On Foods to make an amazing Valentine's Day dinner at home. Okay, first things first, we went to Save On Foods and we got ourselves some delicious beef tenderloin and some prawns, which were already clean for us, so that was amazing. Uh, we kept the tail on because some people like to eat the tail, but you can remove those as well. And what we're going to do with these uh, tenderloin are we're going to season them generously. So that's the biggest step. A lot of people miss that. You have to season your steaks with a lot of seasoning. A lot. So like if you think you're seasoning it too much, go a little bit further. So we're going to add some um, salt and pepper. That's all you need and it uh, enhances the flavor while it's cooking. If your tenderloin is not in nice medallions like this, then you can ask the butcher and they can have uh, butcher's twine and do it for you. So they're in these nice little circles. Okay, so we got some salt, we got some pepper. And then we're going to um, get a pan nice and hot so that we can sear these bad boys up. And you want to preheat your oven at 400 degrees. All right, we have a pan that's on medium high heat. We want it to be really hot. We're gonna add some oil into the pan. We're gonna sear off our steaks before we put them in the oven. So we've got some olive oil in there, nice and hot. And that's the sound you wanna hear, that sizzle. Now you want to cook these undisturbed for about four minutes so they have a nice golden crust on the, the one side and then we're going to flip them over. Okay, so it's been about four minutes and we're going to flip these over. They have a nice delicious crust and then we're going to add a good dash of butter and some fresh thyme and a little bit of garlic. And then we're going to baste these and then put them in the oven. Tenderloin is a really lean cut of meat, so you definitely want to make sure that you add some fat to it to give it some more flavor because it's deliciously tender, but doesn't have the most flavor as most steaks. So adding some butter always helps. Okay, so we are going to throw this into the oven and we're going to cook it for about five to eight minutes. And while that's cooking in the oven, we're going to get ready for our prawns. Okay, so while the steak is cooking in the oven, we're very simply going to cook these prawns. It's very easy. They're already cleaned, so we're just gonna season them with a little bit of salt and pepper. And then we're gonna add some butter to the pan and some garlic, and then we're going to cook them. Very simple. Okay, so, butter. Who doesn't like butter? And it's Valentine's Day, so you're allowed to eat as much butter as you want. And we're gonna add some garlic. And then we're just gonna throw these guys in the pan on medium high heat. Yum, delicious. Basically, I just wanna cook these. They only take a few short minutes, very quick to, to cook. Once they start to turn red, then you know they're gonna be done. Once these are done, we're going to be putting them um, to the side and, until we're ready to serve. All right, let's check on our steak. Okay, so we just removed the steaks out and we put them aside to rest and we're using the jus to make a nice red wine demi-glaze. So we are going to add some onion the rest of our garlic, tiny bit of butter, and saute that up. And then we're gonna deglaze with some red wine. And we'll have ourselves a delicious sauce to drizzle on top. We're gonna let this red wine reduce until it's kind of sticky and thickened up a little bit, and then we'll be ready to serve. Easy. Been easy, easy, easy. Look at that, it was like five minutes. I'm gonna show you how to plate super easy, but restaurant quality. So we've got some simple mashed potatoes and we're just gonna dollop that right in the middle of the plate, like so. And then we're gonna take some 
asparagus, which we just steamed. I'm gonna put it on the bottom right there. And then our beautiful piece of steak tenderloin just on top. And then we've got our delicious garlic prawns. We're gonna just add all around, okay? And then we're gonna top it off with an amazing jus. There you have it guys, a restaurant quality dish for Valentine's Day using Save On Food products of steak and prawns. It's a very quick, easy recipe, but it's absolutely delicious and it will impress your significant other on that special day.